Hello today's video we have the following content. It is said that Zhao Lin spent 100 million to buy a luxury house for her son, and she responded to her former mother-in-law, what's wrong with country pumpkins? For many women, choosing marriage or career is always a headache, and it is also a difficult problem in life. Some people, like Wang Yan, Princess Qing, gave up their careers for marriage. Some people, like Zhao Lin, gave up their marriages for their careers. Their choices are different, and the results are also clear. Some people spend their youth on marriage, but have never been respected by their families. Even their sons look down on them and only regard them as rich wives who eat idle meals. Although some people are abandoned by marriage, they have become strong women who are admired by people by virtue of their persistence in their careers, and have won many respects. In contrast, the natural era obviously tends to women choose the latter. Simply put, the latter is more in line with the concept of the natural era. Zhao Liying chose career instead of marriage. She used practical actions to prove herself to her in-laws and also won the right to speak for herself in society. She used her own efforts and achievements to prove the value of independent women and showed the demeanor of women in the new era. It is rumored that Zhao Liying spent 100 million to buy a luxury house for her son. Recently, there was a report on the internet that Zhao Liying spent 100 million to buy a luxury house for her son. It is said that Zhao Liying has been looking for a house for many years, and finally spent a full 100 million to buy a luxury villa in the fourth ring of Beijing. This house is a two-and-a-half-story villa with a private swimming pool, a garden, and a beautiful artificial lake. From the outside, it looks like a castle, so magnificent. However, this amount of money is actually not a big amount for Zhao Liying now. Zhao Liying is a top figure in the acting circle. She is very popular just by filming and advertising endorsements. Since she played Legend of Lushan, her fame has soared, her value has also risen, and she has naturally made more and more money. Zhao Liying's pay has risen with the hit dramas, and her acting skills have been recognized. Works such as Shan Shang Comes, The Journey of Flower, and Princess Agents have won her many audience favorite awards in the honor of the best actress, consolidating her position as a first-line actress. Not only that, she was successfully selected as one of the four little flowers, proving her strength and influence. Zhao Liying not only makes money from her acting career, she started investing as early as 2015. She has several companies under her name, and she also does business in partnership with Hessen Media, and has established a firm foothold in the entertainment industry. She is really a person who is very good at making money. So, buying a luxury house is a piece of cake for Zhao Liying now. She has been working hard to make money over the years, and she doesn't have any big expenses on weekdays so it's natural that she has a lot of assets. Besides, this villa was bought for her son, so what's there to hesitate about? Just go for it. Feeling guilty about her son. Zhao Liying and Feng Shao Feng, this celebrity couple's marriage experience can be described as twists and turns. From their announcement of marriage in 2018 to the arrival of their lovely son the following year, everything seemed perfect. Unfortunately, the good times didn't last long and their marriage failed to stand the test of time and came to an end in just a few years. Although the relationship between Zhao Liying and Feng Shao Feng may have come to an end, their son Ziang Xiang has become an unavoidable topic between the two. Ziang Xiang's growth and future are undoubtedly their common responsibility and concern. Today, although Zhao Liying and Feng Shao Feng have parted ways, their love for their son will not diminish. I hope they can properly handle their relationship and create a healthy and happy growth environment for Xiang Xiang. Who will take care of our son in the future and who he will follow are all issues we have to consider carefully. They are divorced, but they will still raise their son together. How to raise them together in whose house the son will live in must be discussed carefully. As a mother, Zhao Liying is of course reluctant to part with her two-year-old son. But Fen Shao Feng and his mother also want to raise the child themselves. They don't want him to follow Zhao Liying and call someone else dad in the future. Everyone wants the child to grow up around them. Zhao Liying feels guilty about her son because of her work. Although she hasn't finished breathe feeding yet, she still joined the crew to shoot Yu Fei. As an actor, if there is no work for a long time, the audience may forget it, and the market will not wait for you. Therefore, Zhao Liying is so busy with work that she has no time to accompany her son. The main reason for buying a mansion for my son now is to give him a comfortable living environment, so that he can be closer to my workplace and convenient for us to meet every day. At the same time, this is also to prove my strength to my former mother-in-law, so that she can't say anything, and it can be regarded as a face-saving for myself. Slap the former mother-in-law, 
What's wrong with a rural girl? Comma when Shaolin and Fang Shao Fang got married, Fang Shao Fang's mother didn't think much of her. To be honest, if it weren't for the fact that the two got married with a child, she might not have been able to enter the Fang family at all. Fang Shao Fang's mother was not very satisfied with Shaolin, mainly because she looked down on her family background. Compared with Feng Shei of Feng's background of being born into a wealthy family and his family being a textile tycoon, Zhao Liang, a female star, standing next to their family, is indeed a bit out of place. Not to mention that Zhao Liang was born in the countryside and her family didn't have a big background. The gap in family status is too big. A girl with such conditions is not worthy of his son, and her education level is not high. After getting married and having a child, Fen Shei of Feng's mother especially supports him to continue his acting career, but she doesn't agree with Zhao Liang's work. When Zhao Liang wanted to go out to film, Fen Shei of Feng's mother hoped that she would concentrate on preparing for the second child. In their daily interactions, Feng's mother always puts on a superior look, points fingers at Zhao Liang, and speaks in all kinds of picky ways. Fen Shei of Feng's mother also forced Zhao Liang to change her name, claiming that this would bring him good luck. This request is really speechless. All in all, the grievances Zhao Liang suffered in the wealthy family are hidden in these small details. But now, Zhao Liang easily bought a 100 million mansion for her son. Isn't this obviously for the ex-mother-in-law to see? What's wrong with a rural girl? We can also live a prosperous life. Although Zhao Liang, a rural girl, was born inferior to others, she made a comeback in life and became a real winner in life with a net worth of over 100 million. She was once underestimated and despised, but now she is no longer the same as before. She is a wealthy family and lives her own wonderful life. What do you think about this? Next news. Traveling with the Phoenix Celebration Banquet. The three big guys gathered, Zhao Liang and Lin Jenxin joined together. It's a pity that the three of them are a bit regrettable. Recently, the hit of Celebrating Union 2 has triggered a viewing boom, setting a new high, and the popularity and reputation have steadily increased. At the same time, Singer 2024 has also triggered a nationwide discussion, and the big IP drama Fox Spirit Matchmaker Yu Hong chapter is about to be launched, and the film and television market in May is very lively. Although the final Drama King title has not yet been revealed, Traveling with the Phoenix has been widely recognized as the first hit drama of the year. It is worth mentioning that although Traveling with the Phoenix has ended for nearly two months, its clicks continue to rise, showing a strong subsequent influence. The popularity of the drama not only made the leading actors Zhao Liang, Lin Jenxin, Zen Yanlei and He Yun gain widespread attention and career leaps, but also brought rich benefits to the producers and broadcasting platforms, achieving a win-win situation for all parties. On May 22, Zhao Liang shared a photo of the celebration banquet of traveling with the Phoenix on social media and expressed her inner joy, happy, happy. Later, her studio also forwarded and commented. Congratulations to producer Zhao for his great success. As the heroine and producer of Traveling with Phoenixes, Zhao Liang not only showed superb acting skills and strong ability to resist dramas, but also achieved complete success in her first attempt at behind-the-scenes production and production work. Traveling with Phoenixes director Deng Kei and male lead Lin Jenkson had already got a chin-ching for preparations, but Zhao Liang was busy filming in the world and could not go with them, so the director only shared a photo of her back with Lin Jenkson. Given that most artists and staff are based in Beijing or Shanghai, the show chose Chinqing to hold a celebration banquet, obviously to accommodate Zhao Liang's schedule. Although Chinqing may be slightly inconvenient for some actors to attend the event compared to Beijing and Shanghai, the attendance list and group photos of the celebration banquet of traveling with phoenixes were exposed, and its grand occasion can be seen. In addition to the nine core actors who were all present, Representatives of the producers and the two major broadcasting platforms were also present, and they were all heavyweights in the industry. This grand occasion is enough to show their high recognition and satisfaction with the drama Traveling with Phoenixes and the leading actress Zhao Liang. From the group photo shared by Zhao Liang, we can clearly see that director Deng Kei, screenwriter J.I.U. Lu Fei Xiong and nine participating actors gathered together. The nine actors are Zhao Liang, Lin Jenxin, Zhuan Lu, Su Heikyo, Wang Yiao, Li Zifen, Liu Guanlin, Song Yingfeng and Wei Zixin. It is worth noting that Zhao Liang and Lin Jenxin appeared in the same frame again after the press conference, and Lin Jenxin stood behind Zhao Liang throughout the whole process. The reunion of the two undoubtedly added more highlights to the scene. Unfortunately, 
At the celebration banquet of traveling with the Phoenix, Zen Yun Lei, who played the infatuated male second Mo Feng, and He Yu, who played Fu Rongjin, were unable to attend it to the filming of the crew, and Zen Lei, who played Ling Zun, was also absent due to work reasons. Although three people failed to arrive, the remaining nine people still gathered together to celebrate together. Considering that everyone's work schedule is different, it is normal for He Yu and Zen Yun Lei to film in the crew. In general, the attendance is still neat. On that day, the bigwigs of the investors gathered together, including Myang Deping, president of Mango TV, Wang Wan, president of Tencent Video, CAO Huawei, -E, chairman of New Classics Media, and Hao Ziyanan, president of China Literature Group. These important figures from the broadcasting platform and production investors attended the celebration banquet of traveling with the Phoenix together, showing their high regard for the drama. Although it was not celebrated live like other dramas to further attract attention, its grandness is self-evident just from the weight and pomp of the attendees. People often say no profit, no early rise. In addition to celebrating the achievements of this event, some netizens speculated that the participants may have come with the intention of seeking cooperation. The strong money-making ability shown by Xiao Lin and Lin Jinx in this time has made many investors interested in facilitating their reunion. Therefore, after Princess Agents and traveling with the Phoenix, Zhao Lin and Lin Jinxin are expected to join hands again and start the third cooperation. It must be admitted that although traveling with the Phoenix has a convenient way to make profits through marketing means such as holding concerts, similar to the operation of many popular dramas, it only relies on the support of fans and drama fans. However, the show chose to keep a low profile, which from another perspective may be the secret of its success. It insists on putting the quality of the work first in speaking with strength, rather than just pursuing superficial gimmicks and short-term interests. Although the celebration of traveling with the Phoenix has come to a successful conclusion, it marks a new starting point for the careers of actors such as Yun Lei and Hyu. For Xiao Liang, this is an opportunity to transform from a front-stage actor to a behind-the-scenes actor, and she is expected to bring us more high-quality works. So, are you looking forward to the third collaboration between Lin Jinxin and Xiao Liang? Thank you for watching the video, please leave your opinion in the comments section. Don't forget to press the channel subscription button. If this is the first time you watch a video on the channel, 